Simon says subscribe and click on the bell icon to receive notifications. Hi there everyone and welcome to another lesson. In this video, we're going to learn how to delete multiple empty rows from the table in Excel. So the first thing is that if you have the data in form of a table, you select it and then press Ctrl G. A pop-up like this appears, then go to the option of special and click on blanks. You're going to see that all the areas which are empty, especially with respect to rows, are going to be selected. Now you right click, go to delete and table rows. And simply when you click on table rows, all of the extra empty rows are going to be deleted and your data is neat and systematic. Let's take another example. If the data that you have added is not in form of a proper formatted table, then how do you remove them? The simplest way is you select it and then press Ctrl G. Special, blanks. It's just the same way as we did for the formatted table. Click on OK and the empty rows are selected. Then you right click and when you go to delete, there are four different options. So you've got to select the second one which says to shift cells up. Click on OK and the table is systematically arranged without any empty rows jargon. So that was all for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Take care. Goodbye. If you're not a subscriber, click down below to subscribe so you get notified about similar videos we upload. To see the full course that this video came from, click over there. And click over there to see more videos from Simon Says It.